I, as you know, I said that this surge could succeed. It is succeeding, but it's fragile. It's fragile, my friends. Al Qaeda is on their heels, but they're not defeated. And if we set a date for withdrawal, rather than the conditions on the ground, it will be, I believe, we could reverse all of our success and we could lead to a wider war, increased Iranian influence, et cetera, et cetera. But I think we are, uh, we should realize the benefits of, of winning. And that, of course, is a stable ally in the region, defeating uh, and setting back Al Qaeda and other jihadists and uh, our troops coming home, but they come home with victory and honor and not in defeat. But, and, and could I just say, Senator Obama has said that for after 900 days, more than 900 days, he is going to Iraq. I'm glad he's going. For the first time, for the first time, he will seek to, see, uh, to receive a sit-down briefing with General David Petraeus. I'm glad he's going. I offered to go with him, by the way. Uh, I didn't offer to fly the airplane, but I offered to. <laughs> but I will wait and see what Senator Obama has to say when he returns. But my friends, we will never, ever have a situation where we would have to send our young Americans back again because we didn't see this thing all the way through. And so.